Quick question. Everybody's asking if the car has no gears, how come it has paddles on the steering wheel? Very good question. So if you look around the interior, there aren't a lot of buttons or anything, and for sure there isn't any central shifting mechanism for going for to reverse, park, neutral, or anything like that. So the first function they have is that if you push both, you're standing still, you get park, if you're not in park already. If you hold them longer for five seconds, you get neutral, so you can push the car. In park, the electric handbrake is also pulled automatically. Similar again to an electric car like a Tesla, you don't have a handbrake lever or anything, it's just depending on the mode you're in, it's on or off, and the speed you're in. So when you push the brake and you push plus, you get into drive mode. Mm -hmm. uh, if you hold them both together, push the brakes, you're in, in park or neutral, depending on your speed, and minus is reverse. So you're controlling your forward, neutral, park, or reverse motion. Okay. Then we can do some more fun stuff with it. For example, if you're on the highway and you, you for some reason, have drained your battery low, and you, you're still driving because you have the combustion in you, but you want full power because someone is pulling up next to you, <laughs> yes. you, can, you can hold, for example, the plus in a little while, and then the car knows you want to charge the battery really quickly up because you need to use full power soon if it's not full already. And you, then you get into power generation mode. You heard the engine kind of firming up a bit and you're just pushing in the energy into the cell and then when you release it you shoot off like a gun. Something like that. But there is no real reason why the battery would be drained when you're driving like that. Unless you did like three laps on the numbering, yeah, okay. the battery drains together with a fuel tank to low in yes. about three laps. Okay. If you yeah, go yeah. full. If you don't go full, well, any, any car generate. runs out uh, yeah. pretty quick at the nerve overing. Yeah. It takes a couple much. of laps before you, you empty the fuel tank and the battery simultaneously. Okay, brilliant. Thank you very much. Thank you. I hope you're enjoying my content from this year's Geneva Motor Show. Be sure to check out videos of all of the other new releases right here on the Shmi 150 channel. And of course, be subscribed for plenty more supercar videos in the future. Thanks again for watching and I'll catch up with you very soon. Cheers.